Okay, the fourth stage is the production stage. Uh, the students will produce whatever it is that they are going to do, whether it's a podcast or it's a poster session or it's a video, or maybe it's a presentation. The idea is that they will use all of the skills that they have gathered in that scaffolding stage and produce. Now, from the perspective of Steely, that production is very often judged too highly from a faculty member's um, grading schema. And that really depends. If, if you have been able to do small tasks in the consume, analyze, and scaffolding stages, the production should not be as big of a deal as uh, a lot of people make it out to be. It's better to have the product just be the product. Remember, what we're doing is we are learning a method of communication. So they are learning how to do a podcast, for example. And if they learn how to do a podcast, um, they should be learning all along the way of how to find a good podcast in the consume stage, how to analyze and judge that podcast in the analysis stage, um, how to discover the skills they'll need to create a podcast of their own in the scaffolding stage, how to put everything together in the production stage, but that's not necessarily the end all and be all. Um, so having students put things together is great, but uh, more important than that is to have something like the production stage happen at a time in the semester when they still have time then to assess what it is that they've done. And that's the last stage.